two weeks since I've filmed and it feels like two months. Am I going to be rusty? Am I not going to be funny? I don't know. Maybe I'm just far too relaxed. Hello and welcome back to the channel. Thank you for all the comments on my videos whilst I was away. It was really kind and thank you so much. So I'm back now, yes, and I'm so excited to film loads more videos for this year and all the years to come. What am I talking about? When I was on holiday out, I missed filming so much. I was like, oh, an idea. I can't film it. Ugh. So speaking of the holiday, I'm going to talk about what happened on the holiday that I just went to. I went to Greece and oh my god, it was amazing. I'm just going to tell you everything that happened. Oh, like literally, I was so relaxed. It was a joke. Like, I was like, someone wake me up now. Like, someone wake me up. If anybody knows me really well, you know I needed this holiday. Like, seriously, my mind was frazzled. I, I didn't know what I was doing. I had a load of crap going on. So, you know, I really need the holiday and I come back, I feel so refreshed and thinking about things and I'm like, why? Why was I like that? Now I feel refreshed, like I've just said, but I'm ready to film and do loads of stuff. So yeah, anyway, let's get back onto the video and let's talk about the holiday. So we took a taxi there and I am not good with car rides and I didn't eat anything beforehand and it's an hour and a half from my, ho my house my house to the airport and oh i wish i had something to eat i felt so sick oh oh i just hate car rides then we got to the airport it was dead i was like are we at the right airport it was dead i was like okay we handed in all the suitcases and then we got to security and i'm like oh here we go now I'm, i've got a history with security like every time i go through those doors something beeps that I have on me. It's usually a belt or something, so I took precautions this time, took off the belt. So I went through the gates, I was like, yeah, it's gonna beep. It didn't. What? I think I raised more suspicion not getting beeped than if I did get beeped. And the, everyone was like, okay. I was like, no, I'm so sorry. I was just, I get beeped all the time. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, that, that was a, that was a highlight for me. And then we got to, to the plane. Oh my God. I love, I love the plane. The only bit I hate is the landing. Now you're probably thinking, well, what about the takeoff and the middle part? It's the ears. It hurts my ears. Really hurts my ears. Like, ow. I kind of got over that. The views were amazing. That it just distracted you from the painful earache. The clouds are like little balls of cotton wool or candy floss. It's so weird. You want to jump on it, but then you know, oh, if I jump on it, it'll probably go straight through and then splat on the floor. But you know, I'm willing to take the risk. But we got to our accommodation and it is called Yanis Village. And it's in a great area in Sidari in Greece. And oh, it looks so welcoming and it looks so professional and it looks, just a nice place to be. There's a pool and you, trust me, you needed to get in that pool because the, the heat is just, even if you're in the shade, the heat is just like so hot. Not like unbearable, but just like, oh my God, might need to get an ice cream soon. There's air hockey tables, there's a basketball machine thing where you just throw balls into a hoop. Me and Taylor got the high score. Now this might seem boring to some people. There was bingo, there was quiz nights. Now, my grandparents haven't been on holiday since I was born and that was 21 years ago. Yes, 21 years. So they wanted to ease into the first week and I like bingo, I like quizzes. It's a family friendly place, so what's the problem? Holidays are to relax. Now, I don't understand why you'd want to go off and I don't know, jump off a cliff. If that's your kind of holiday, that's that's cool, that's cool. But um, yeah, we did those kind of out of the ordinary things on the second week. So yeah. <laughs> anyway, the first quiz we did, we were the champions. So I mean, why would you not take the opportunity to get more money? Go off and jump off a cliff, earn more money. 
I think I know what I'll do. I'll do. I think I know what i do. The food in Greece. Oh my God, you could have like, some of the portions, you could have had it for like three people. Like there was a giant garlic bread. There was like half a cow on your plate. The ice cream, oh. Now nah, I've never had a chocolate souffle, but oh. You cut into that bad boy and all the stuff comes out of froth. There was a restaurant called The Three Little Pigs and whilst you're having your food, you're like, oh yeah, this is a nice setting. And then the lights go down. I'm like, how am I supposed to eat my meal? And then they start shooting fire up the wall and throwing plates and they start dancing around the fire. I'm like, what? what? <laughs> Actual fire up the freaking walls. So I was like, this little kid was starting dancing as well in the fire, not in the fire, but around the fire. I was like, this kid's got guts. And also there was a Greek night at the place we stayed and that was interesting. The dancers said they needed um, volunteers. So I got dragged by Emma, one of the owners. And then we went downstairs and then got changed. They put me in this outfit and then taught us a dance got to know us a little bit whilst there was like it was like an interval kind of thing so people upstairs were like drinking just waiting i was like <gasps> like i'm not very good at social social situations let alone a freaking load of people i was like <gasps> i was freaking out i was like i was talking to the two other girls that were picked as well i was like oh my god help me like you had to hold the hands i was like i think my hands were really sweaty as well so <laughs> When I was holding their hands, I was like, I apologise, I know my hands are really sweaty. They're like, oh no, it's okay, ours is sweaty too. But yeah, this is what happened. please please i'm gonna go now i'm gonna go and move country i'm actually gonna move to america because that is so embarrassing i wore a freaking skirt or dress or whatever it <laughs> they introduced me as an old grandma at the end i was like oh no this is so embarrassing but after a few cocktails the cocktails are amazing after a few cocktails I kind of got over it. Then a few nights after, it was my grandparents' 50th wedding anniversary. I know, 50 years of marriage, like how, how? The owners had a cake made for them. They had a little table laid out for them and they were dancing to a very special song of theirs. If you're on my Instagram, you would have seen the dancing, but if you haven't, then here you go. <laughs> In the final week, we went to Corfu Town and 
it's just so old, but then so nice and like, it's so like Instagram worthy. Like, oh my God, this look good on Instagram. Everywhere you turn, there's like a different shop or something different to look at. And it's just like, uh, uh, there was a McDonald's there, a McDonald's in like an oldish area. And it was like, what? And there was a Starbucks there down the corner. I was like, what? And it was a very different Starbucks. I got a few jokes and a few gifts, but I'll show you my favorite video next week. And yeah, that was, um, <laughs> that was funny. Oh, before I forget, Kyle and Kane bought my Nana a, <laughs> you know, the male private parts, yeah. Well, they had those in some of the gift shops. I was like, okay, it's wooden. Like, it's like a key ring kind of thing. <laughs> And um, they got her one as a key ring and it was wooden. It was about this size. <laughs> and they were like, oh, here you go. We got, we spent some money for it on you. And um, she opened it. She was like, oh, it was so funny. A few days after we went on a boat trip, I was a bit skeptical. I was like, oh, I don't know. Like it's a boat. I'm not very good with water, but we'll, we'll give it a go. I loved it. The views were amazing. They stopped at like different areas of the island, like little private beaches or just little bits of ocean. And they just stopped and like, oh, you can jump in now. I didn't jump in. I was like, no, 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 I'm just gonna drown. But you got to, you got to throw in bread and these fish just got jumped up and grabbed the bread and ripped it apart. I was like, Whoa, someone's hungry. But yeah, you got to go on the private beach. It was so nice. And then we got to go around like the whole island. You got to see loads of different posh villas. Like we got to see Prince Charles and Camilla's villa, like castle thing. It was, oh my God, like, whoa, that was a lot of money. <laughs> we got to see the owner of Mercedes, the car brand, their villa. Like, oh, like I wanted that villa. And then you see some like, some in the distance, you're like, yeah, they have totally been used for X Factor judges' houses or something like, they looked like something that you'd see on the X Factor. And finally, what made the holiday were my family. Oh, so funny. Like the pictures we took, like, <laughs> they've got serious issues. Like my Nana, she slipped in the pool. Like, she didn't slippy, she nearly drowned. My little sister had to drag her back up. <laughs> they are just so special in a weird way. Like, sometimes I was like, I'm not with these guys. I'm just um, one of the reps. But um, no, it was just, yeah. By the way, I should have started a bloody lookbook. The amount of different outfits I had and then I took pictures of and then at the end of the haul I was like, wow, I took pictures of every outfit. What is wrong with me?
did it honestly one of the best holidays I've ever had like we've been to Greece before two years ago but the added addition with my grandparents it just made it a whole lot better it was like I want to go back but I think I'm gonna save up and maybe go to America next year that's kind of in the pipeline right now like I don't know how I'm gonna do it but I'm gonna do it don't know how but I'm gonna do it whether it's next year or the year after I'm definitely going within the next few years because I don't care now like my family are not very like flight friendly you, you know and America's like nine hours or something they can hardly do three hours but I'm fine with it so an, an added extra six hours that'll be fine like there's films on the plane plus I can sleep plus I can chat to whoever I'm sat next to but you know I, I, I'm just so psyched to go to America because there's so many people I, I know that are from America and I'd like to get to like actually see them so yeah that's um that's a dream of mine again thank you guys for watching and thank you for watching the videos that are on here when I was on holiday like like I said before at the start like thank you it's just like it was overwhelming I know like gaming videos like whoa like what are you doing Ryan I know they haven't been watched as much as um like these kind of videos but I don't mind like it was something different for people like I know some people who watch this are gamers and they'll be like yeah yeah we're gamers we'd like to see you do gaming so I was like yeah I'll do gaming and Batman chapter two no chapter episode two is coming out in a few weeks so I'm going to do that so that's going to be exciting plus I'm going to do these kind of videos again and favorite video yeah I kind of missed it so I'm going to do I'm going to do July and August next week so that's going to be great that's going to be a long video but who cares don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it and want to go to Greece and comment down below anything you want me to do in the future for this channel or I don't know comment if you like this video I don't know I think I feel like I've blabbed on but hopefully you enjoyed this video I don't know please subscribe if you enjoyed this video and <laughs> but yeah please subscribe and thank you for watching and I'll talk to you guys later bye